In this movie clip, I'm going to show you how to view LAMPRO data uh, from uh, within Visual LAMPRO GIS while working with a map. I'm going to go ahead and open my list of prospects. From here, I can uh, view a general picture of what each one of my prospects looks like. And then I can go ahead and open a prospect. And uh, from the prospect edit screen, I can actually access the full GIS window. Okay, so now I'm looking at my prospect TX001. At this point, I can select individual um, subtracts within my prospect or even multiple subtracts. And then from there, I can view different. Uh, Land Pro data grids. For example, show me the mineral ownership on these four subtracts. Show me what uh, leases I have on these subtracts. And then it's just a matter of clicking that button, and Land Pro will show you all of the, in this case, all of the leases. And then the lease analyst can go ahead and go into the lease just by double clicking. I'm now editing that lease, and I have access to every single uh, page of information. I can make changes. Uh, save, close, and uh, even uh, run reports. So even from here I can uh, right click and say preview. Go ahead and give me for example a lease data sheet on the current lease. And now I'm going to go and look at a lease data sheet. And there's my lease data sheet. Other items that I can look at would be, for example, mineral ownership. So let me go ahead and select additional features, and now I'm going to turn on my mineral ownership. And these are all the mineral ownership records for the features that I selected. And also from here, you have access not only to all the reports, but also let's say you want to bring out the ownership data out to, say, Microsoft Excel. Lampro allows you to quickly bring out all of this data to Excel. There you are. Okay, let's close this Excel spreadsheet back in Lampro. And uh, some of the other data that we can look at are um, perhaps contracts. There's a list of all of the contracts covering the one particular feature. If I want to see contracts covering other features, I would just go and select those features and then I would hit contracts and it will show me all the contracts affecting that. And again, I can do contract data sheets or uh, open uh, each contract. And uh, other items is uh, chain of title and uh, related properties. This is the related properties screen. And uh, let's see, chain of title. This would show us any instrument associated again with the polygons that we selected, showing us grantor grantees, as well as filing information for uh, each instrument. So this is pretty nice. This will show us the actual land pro data specific to each polygon. Okay, I'm going to add another layer now, one of my tracked layers. And from the track layer, I'm going to go ahead and uh, zoom in a little bit more. And then I'm going to turn on information. I can turn on all sorts of labels, you know, land product data, for example, tract ID or the description of the tract, ownership information, you know, mineral interest, surface interest, leases. So all sorts of land product data can also be displayed on there. You just pick and choose what labels you want to see, and then Lampro will display them on your screen. We're going to go into a different movie clip to show you more information about the labels here in a minute.